The Active Straight Leg Raise test is a very simple assessment to check your readiness for things like squatting and any kind of hinge movement, which is going to be a deadlift, a kettlebell swing, anything like that. So what you're going to do is lay down on the floor, put your knee next to some kind of vertical post, whether it's a rig or a door frame, doesn't matter. You're gonna lie down flat, put your knee next to that vertical post, and you're gonna raise one leg as high as you can. And what we're looking for is to make sure that your ankle joint can make it past that vertical marker. If it can, great. You're gonna check the other side, make sure you can do it on each leg. We wanna make sure that you can pass this test so that you're safe to squat and deadlift. If you don't pass the test, it doesn't mean that you can't squat, and can't deadlift, but modifications need to be made. We need to limit your range of motion and probably limit your load so that you can successfully do some version of that motor pattern. When you're recording your score in the Train Heroic app, you're going to either mark a zero, meaning your ankle joint didn't make it past the vertical post, or you're gonna mark a one, meaning you did make it past the vertical post. This is mostly just to check progress. We wanna see at the end of the program if things have gotten better, if things have changed. If you struggle with the active straight leg raise assessment and you get a zero on either or both sides, you're gonna to wanna to spend more time on your hamstring mobility as well as your hip flexor mobility. Now, it may just feel like your hamstrings are tight. You may swear it's just your hamstrings, that's where you feel tight. Just because that's where the tightness is, it doesn't necessarily mean that that's actually tight. It's just that that's where whatever is limiting your range of motion, your hamstrings are, are gonna get the sensation that they're tight. So work both.